Oh, to make sure she's okay. You know what I'm saying? Look at the mama. I don't know what you're doing, mama, but this is the problem when women want to establish their dominance over a man. When women don't allow the man to initiate the dominance and order and structure in the house. I'm not trying to be mean. Just like for, for a, a man, when a father don't let a son have both, because I think a son need man and woman. I think the daughter need man and woman. You know what I mean? So if a man is not letting... Girl, mom can't dance. This like still your man. Christian Louis Vuitton's no van. Ring so big, can't ball my hand. D wag, all white bands. Black jewel, all white friends. In Gucci, blue like. Many of you have problems finding clothes, but if you look in the description box for the information, you can find information for Top Notch clothing brand. Top Notch MME is a high-end street wear brand for men and women with a top-notch sense of style. And look, guys, I, I wear it. I just bought my own clothing, and they're top-notch for real. Look, they're not just a top-notch brand. They're a way of life. Go get your own very own top-notch brand clothing. Look, I'm about to drop some jewels about Yaya Mayweather and NBA Youngboy situation. Y'all look in the links in the description box. Go check out our top notch. Go check out our emails, social media platform, and hit that like button. Thank you. What's good, YouTube family, man? This your God bless. One thing for watching another episode of I Smoke Hip Hop Live, man. Let's get in tune with it. Today's episode, we're going to speak about Yaya Mayweather getting pregnant by NBA Youngboy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh boy, Yaya Mayweather just got pregnant by a nigga that already got a hundred kids. A nigga that already proved he don't give two dams about her. A nigga that let the baby mama dish rag Yaya and then Yaya had to supposedly allegedly defend herself and hit up the other lady who we're now finding might not be NBA Youngboy's baby mama on top of all the other baby mamas that he got. Y'all tell me what craziness behind this mess, bro. Look, I'm about to go in right quick because I got a daughter too. So Floor Mayweather, I'm not gonna be one of these fake people to be out here, it's Floyd's fault. Not gonna do that. We don't know what type of great father he is. He's out here providing for his family, folks. We're not gonna say Floor Mayweather failed his daughter. It's so easy to say a parent because we see a kid turn up doing a lot of fluke things out here to say it's the parent fault. It's the easiest cliche thing I've heard all my life. Oh, the parents failed them. Oh, when are we gonna take accountabilities when we reach a certain age in life? This girl been affluent, wealth, been around many things to shape her mind different than a lot of us, and she still has the dumb nigga mentality. So we gotta look at her and start blaming the individual. I got a daughter, man. And I teach my daughter a whole lot about the game. I teach her about the F boys. I teach her about how dudes just play these females. Let's just keep it real, folks. I ain't simping. Dudes play females to get what we want. Me too, I'm guilty too. So when I see a Yaya, I see a female that feel she, she already knows more in the world and nobody can't tell her nothing, bro. And I see a dude like NBA Youngboy. It's not my job to tell him who to fuck, who to sleep with, who not to like. But bro, bro, you know what family she come from, bro. You know damn well, because I'm just like you, NBA. We just love all these women, bro. But you know you was going to be lower than that girl, bro. You know what she got going. And I'm not blaming the NBA, young boy. I'm just saying more fellas. Sometimes just let a female know what it is. Just let her ass know what it is. And a lot of the cases, these females already was told what it is. So I'm going to be fair to NBA, young boy, too. A lot of the times, these girls know what's up. But they get attracted to that, bro. I done seen... Niggas try to change their life and be the corny nigga for once in their life and they get dismissed and mistreated like they ain't nothing, bro. So when girls look at these bad dudes, they get turned on by that, bro. They hear, hear you beating this other chick up. They gonna preach and, oh, this is wrong and all that. But inside of her head, bro, she going crazy for you, bro. She wants you, bro. I done seen niggas use his last money that he used his whole summer job to buy this girl some jewelry or whatnot. And the whole time she getting bust down, by the whole team, bro. Just ran through. She ain't let this dude smell the tussie yet, bro. She, he, he didn't get the touch, finger, nothing, bro. But all the guys, shit, they can call her right now and she'll give them knob on the dog, um, the slob on the job, knob job, bro. Bet she she'll get on the knees for the nigga, bro. But for you, she got you doing X, Y, and Z. This is the yayas of the world. 
this is why we did a whole live about women like that yesterday. Y'all need to go check out the replay. Girls like that don't give a damn, bro. They watching you, bro. They seeing who the hell you is, bro. What you got going on, who you in tune with, what they can get out of you as far as an adventure, bro. This whole thing is an adventure for them, bro. Once the adventure is over with, they erase it and they go back to square one, bro. They go back to square one, bro. And the square one is the lost land. Yeah, yeah. NBA, young boy already got this chick open, bro. He ain't gonna be the last. He ain't gonna be the last. Mayweather, if you weren't, look, Floyd, you weren't about NBA young boy right now. You better focus on her because it ain't too late for her, bro. Yeah, she got a baby and all that. She stuck with this nigga forever. But she can still get worse. These girls be having multiple kids by multiple dudes, STDs, a whole lot. It can get worse. So do not give up on that girl yet, bruh. You need to get in her life right now. And you probably are in her life, but I don't know what to tell you other than, man, fight. Fight to get your daughter back because your daughter's mind is gone. She's so gone right now. She's not looking at her future. She's not looking at the wealth that the daddy built up generational wealth to make sure she's okay. You know what I'm saying? Look at the mama. I don't know what you're doing, mama, but this is the problem when women want to establish their dominance over a man. When women don't allow the man to initiate the dominance in order and structure in the house. I'm not trying to be mean, just like for, for a, a man, when a father don't let a son have both, because I think a son need man and woman. I think the daughter need man and woman. You know what I mean? So if a man is not letting the son get used to mom then you fell in your son if a woman not letting the daughter get used to dad you fell in your kids too it goes both ways bro yaya is gonna get ran through bro this the industry shit ain't over for her because we know all rappers don't get the day you ain't no jay-z you don't get to be the next tupac forever so nba young boy gonna slowly go down soon maybe not now just wait for it bro I, i'm it's undefeated hip-hop is undefeated and washing off niggas bro you fell off and now you washed, you washed up, bro. And, and when NBA young boy get washed up and the whole adventure, the spontaneous moment ain't there no more and, and the money start fading away. And it's not even the money with these type of females because y'all y'all come from money. It's the excitement and this nigga being relevant. I, I know it, bro. It's the excitement, bro. When you, when you that nigga right now, bro, you can literally get caught with three girls sucking on your wood tip, bro. And your baby mama or girlfriend or whatever can see you. But because you that nigga right now, bro, she ain't going nowhere, bro. She gonna make a whole show. She gonna fluke out. She gonna snap on you, bro. She gonna do all that, bro. But she gone, bro. What? She for you, bro. She mentally gone, bro. You could be Geppetto. You could be mini puppet master. You can control her. Tell her what she need to hear. Not, I mean, what she wants to hear instead of what she needs to hear. Niggas gaming her right now, man. Why, man? NBA young boy doing a smart money move. Y'all, y'all come from money. At least I'm gonna get a baby mama that even if I have to pay her child support right now, when Floyd done transfer the wealth to her or whatever, as she get a little bit older, I know I'm taking care of right there. She ain't thirsty like future and them baby mama or the rest of the six, nine baby mama. And these baby mamas that always gotta be in the camera. Nah, she already come from the stardom. She don't need no relevancy. She just wanna chase relevancy. Yeah, she chasing the dick, bruh. Pause, bro. I don't know what this nigga sex game like, but I know this whole thing is being hooked and stuck on some lust. Not love. It's the three L's. Lonely, lust, and love. And you get all three confused, bro. She lost right now. She got a whole baby out here, bro. A whole baby. What you gonna do with that baby, girl? You got a whole baby out here, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. This don't look good. This this look wild as hell. I, I, I can't cap. It just look wild. I'm trying to dismiss it, but it's like she got a whole baby out here and her baby has like a hundred brothers and sisters. And it'll be one thing if NBA was loving all the females the same. I think it's nothing wrong having multiple women. I think God made women for men and I think he made them by the droves for us. Like we can have the choosings of much we like, but I feel like you got to treat all of them the same, bro. You got to give all of them love, bro. And the shit we see going on, bro, you don't manage your career right, bro. You ain't managing your little situation right. NBA young boy look crazy, but the one who look way more crazier is always going to be Yaya Mayweather. And guess what? It fall back to mama and daddy. Now Floyd is out here. You look spooked, bro. You look wild as hell, Floyd. I, I ain't going to cap, bro. You look wild. It look like beyond uh, measures of repair, bro. And I just be sitting back like, not Floyd, man. 
Nah, don't like nah, bro. Not floored, man. But it's floored, yeah. Floored, yeah. Floored. Money, man, money, money, man. Floored, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Mr. Showtime, Mr. Pay-Per-View, used to be Mr. HBO. Money Man, his whole little baby girl pregnant out here by a no good rapper, bro. Not that I'm calling him be a young boy no good, but let's just be real. Do you, ladies, fellas, y'all want y'all daughters to be married to an NBA young boy? Now, a fuck nigga and a fuck whole educational purpose gonna be like, yeah, he got money, and that's what make you an ain't shit parent. Just because a nigga got money, you want your daughter to be with that? You want her to be exploited to that? Look, I want a dude who works. I want a dude who has money. But at the same time, the main thing that matters, I want that dude to love my daughter, bro. I want her, I want him to ride for my daughter and don't dismiss her and treat her like she just garbage out here, bro. Women do need to be deserved with some type of respect, bro. I know it sound cool and all that to shit on women, cause a lot of grimy ass hoes is out here, but not every female is a hoe and not every female is grimy. And some females, if they are a hoe and grimy, nigga ain't that your job to clean it up. Make her better then, bruh. If you don't wanna deal with her, let her go. That's all I'm saying. I ain't saying being a simp. Let her go if you don't want to build her up and mold her to a better Yaya Mayweather. You don't want to do that? And be a young boy, you got thirsty hood rats everywhere. Let her go. Go get another rich bitch pregnant. Educational purpose. And I can't force NBA young boy to do it. That's why it's a tough situation. Yaya Mayweather is pregnant, and we got to fall back and pretend this ain't a drama waiting to happen, becoming some big nightmare is even more bigger than this. Remember, court case still going on, ladies and gentlemen. But they got the best money lawyers could buy, so they're gonna drag out that case for a long time. To the point, they're probably gonna make baby girl settle behind the scene. You know, the other baby mama she hit up. They're gonna do some settlements. Trust me, man. Floyd got too much cash to be trying to let this drama shit linger around, man. Look, I, I feel sorry for the Mayweather family, man. But get 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 your house right in order, man. I need everybody to learn from this experience. Get your house in order, or you will be having an NBA young boy as your son-in-law. Look, I'm. I'm blessed one, man. Love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed, everybody. One. Thank you for watching a good video, y'all. Make sure you hit that like button, you comment, share, and subscribe. Look at the links in the description box. Show some love to the channel, Cash App, PayPal, or just look at what we have to get engaged with the channel. Salute to everybody watching. Sorry that I don't know how to love. Sorry that I don't know how to love. Yeah. I'm sorry that I made you feel that way to change up. Think about all the time.